All right, so let's go ahead and read all the records stored in our person table. So to grab the records from this table, we have to issue this SQL command. So we have to say select, and we're going to select star. So I'm going to explain what star means in a second, and then say from, and then the actual table name, so person, and that with a semicolon. So if I clear the screen first, and then run this command, you can see that we get two people in our table. So first you can see that we have Anne and then we have Jake and the ID is actually managed by the sequence. So one and then two. So the actual star keyword, so select star means that you want to select every single column from this table. So if I was simply to say select and then uh, nothing. So select from person and then enter. You see that we get two rows, but we haven't selected anything. So I can go ahead and say select and then for example, first name and then from person. And that with a semicolon. And if I press enter, now you can see that we only got back Anne and Jake. So we simply selected the first column. Let's go ahead and select first and last name. So select first name. And then if you want a second column, go ahead and press comma and then say second and then name. There we go. So if I press enter, oh, actually second name doesn't exist. So it should be last name, my bad. Enter and you can see that we have Anne and then Smith, Jake and then Jones. Now let's go ahead and select email to see what you know happens if we select someone that doesn't have an email. So I'm going to do select. I'm going to say from person. If I press enter, you can see that the first row is empty, right? It's so it doesn't have a value. And that's true because and she didn't have an email right here. So if I now scroll down, and let me simply go ahead and say select. So just let me press up a couple of times. So select star from person. There we go. And this is how you perform the very basic read operation, which is selecting everyone from this table. This is all for now. If you have any questions, go ahead and drop me a message. Otherwise, join me in the next video. See ya.